So the allegation that has been floating around is Lil Uzi got Britney Bird pregnant. Now, just days ago, she and her team reported to law officials, the police, that Lil Uzi pointed a gun to her stomach. Not only that, but her manager said Lil Uzi put hands on her. Now, according to them, this happened because Lil Uzi believed that she was on a date with St. John. And here is where it gets tricky. Supporters believe he pointed that gun to her stomach to send a message. Do we agree or disagree? Do you believe that Britney and her team is lying on Lil Uzi? Could she possibly be pregnant or bloated? Let me know in my comment section below. And now we got baby Joe in the office. So some time back, I told y'all that he got shot. As of now, he is still recovering in the hospital. As you can see, he's trying to gain his strength back. Fulio, on the other hand, finds this situation very funny. He says they put him on the shitter look at the toilet but of course that is not all he had to say about the nba game this week his circle is full of like yes man like do boys so they're not gonna tell him he wrong you know what i'm saying Julio called everybody in young way circle a do boy now if you don't know what a do boy is to make a long story short basically an individual that is willing to do anything to make his superior happy different definitions for different situations now we got london on the track and summer walker in the office now we all know they break up every other week and if she's not on the internet talking about how bad of a father he is then his other baby mother Abby Ebony is. Now we all know that Ebony and London, they do not get along. Summer and Ebony, they do not get along, but the tables have turned. According to Ebony, now that Summer is out of London's life, she and Summer is getting along just fine. And he's finally connecting with his daughter, with their daughter. The video you just saw was London teaching his daughter the piano. His baby mother, Ebony, reposted this video to her Instagram page. A supporter said, so sweet that y'all magically get along now that Summer's out of the picture. In agreement, she says, right. She then says, y'all chill. I don't have any beef or hard feeling towards a soul in the world. I been let all of that go and you should too. Summer responded and basically said that Ebony tried to blame her for London not being there for his daughter in the past. Ebony says, hey Summer, stay off my page. I just told London I do not have a problem with you, but I see you are still a stupid, stinking slut. At this point, you want to be just like me. Now you got a baby with my baby daddy and you are saying the same exact thing I was saying last year. Now I got a serious question because this seems to me to be some serious beef. By any chance, was Summer screwing London while London was with Ebony? Did she intervene in their relationship? Because this seems so personal. Speaking of personal, it's a must we talk about this. Now, please excuse the kitty cat print, but on her nails, it reads Kanye West. Her caption reads, fuck him all night. So she dropped some new music and supporters instantly insinuated that she wanted to have sex with Kanye West but according to her she already did it she also reposted this to her story she explained on her story that she's dated a ton of white guys who work for Kanye and they are always like oh my god Azalea Kanye is obsessed with you and he loves you and she was like why am I dating these born white men when I could be dating the Kanye West so is the very vocal Azalea Banks exaggerating or could she possibly be telling the truth do you believe that she is Kanye West type yes and no let me know in my comment section below please like this video I love Y'all, thanks for watching, and I'm out.